raucous of a virtuoso, the precision of a finely tuned instrument, the discipline of Lisa Schaefer's life has brought her here, accomplished and very aware of her blessings. November 6, 2013, Lisa was biking west on Winchester Road going to meet her daughter for lunch. She never made it. A tractor trailer uh, hit a woman on a bicycle and her leg is pinned underneath the rear tire. And by the time I got up on my forearms and looked to my right, my right leg was pinned under the bike. The semi driver said he never saw Lisa's bike while a passerby called her husband. He ran a half a block down the road because he didn't want my husband to hear me screaming. A nurse stopped and held her hand. The injuries to Lisa's leg were severe. Two and a half months in the hospital, 10 surgeries, some just to clean out debris. They were pulling out uh, McDonald's wrappers and dirt. Doctors were pleased they had saved her leg, but Lisa went home with open wounds that might never heal. Well, I couldn't imagine this being what for the rest of my life and chronic debilitating pain. I tell you, there's some, there's some ho horrible dark days. Lisa describes standing on the balcony of her apartment at Park Plaza. And I looked over the edge and thought, will 16 floors do it? Will 16 floors do it so that I'm not a burden to have, you know, my family? You really stood there and you but those are gone. Gone because Lisa's terribly mangled leg. All of the tissue um, and muscle was pulled off with my leg. Is now gone. When saving her leg meant nearly losing her sanity, Lisa made a bold choice. You couldn't give me that leg back. You couldn't give me that leg back. You couldn't believe how good this is for you, like, you know, for balance. Lisa told doctors to amputate, and immediately after, the pain was gone. I'm lucky. In less than a year with her prosthetic, Lisa is nearly back to her old life, and most important, back behind her cello. While the accident took a lot from Lisa, it did not take her music. It would have taken my life breath away if it had. And it did not take her ability to live life on her own terms. When I'm playing, I'm thinking, I'm here. I'm here. I almost wasn't. And I'm in the middle of this, and I'm lucky.